Hello, my name is Alex. Uh, I'm an eighth semester computer science engineer, and this is my project for my computer vision class. So what we do here is we got a motion detector, which uh, uses a simple subtraction from uh, the current frame by the old frame, which uh, we previously defined. So what we got here is we we got a program divided in three sections. One is the first section, which executes all the code, and then here in the headers, we just define all the operations that we're gonna use. For starters, uh, what we got here is a bunch of operations to apply different filters, such as Gaussian filter, medium filter, e erosion, black hat, which are morpho morphological operations as well as contrast stretching and threshold. So we're gonna start the program doing a make run. And okay, first for the motion detector, we are getting the input through the webcam and here we can see that it's detecting the motion. And for the video part, we got here a girl singing and as you can see, is detecting the movement and we got here all of the different filters which we're going to apply it in just a second and okay here okay so here you got the filter for the medium which is here the Gaussian filter which is going to be applied here and the the kernel which is for the morphological operations such as erosion and all of that and if we just run it again because the video just stopped okay, here you can see all of the things that are happening such as here in where we dilate and same as well with the uh, opening and closure aperture black hat and all of that and if we move the, the the track bar it changes same as here with threshold which is applied here contrast stretching which it's right here you can see it it's all it's getting applied to the video that has been preloaded and that is it so for the operations such as contrast stretching these are defined here so what we got here is it's a, a function of type mat which takes the frame and an integer which is the threshold that has been applied to the to the to the track bar and here what we what we what we do first is transform the frame that we're getting through the video and we uh, we change it to to a grayscale after that we define an, an empty well a matrix which contains zeros and then we do as as it, as it was shown in class and same for the contrast stretching takes the frame takes two integers which is M and K, for, and we got a logistics which does all the all the mathematical functions, and that is that is pretty much it. And we got two functions which uh, which are used for motion detection. One is for the video that that has been already preloaded, and the other one is for the input feed through the webcam. And that is it. Thank you.